हेलो नमस्कार दोस्तों हेलो फ्रेंड्स थैंक यू फॉर वाचिंग माय वीडियो दिस इज कॉमोडिटी मार्केट डेली विद एसडी ये वीडियो में मैं कॉमोडिटी मार्केट जो लार्जली हम लोग इंडिया से ट्रेड करते हैं वहां मल्टी कॉमोडिटी एक्सचेंज उसमें अपॉर्चुनिटीज देखते हैं इन द डेली टाइम फ्रेम डिफरेंट टाइम फ्रेम डिफरेंट बात कर सकता है डिफरेंट अपॉर्चुनिटीज प्रोड्यूस कर सकता है बट हम लोग यहाँ पे जो काम कर रहे हैं वो डेली चार्ट के बेसिस पे और ये लार्जली मैं करता हूँ मेरा जो लर्नर्स है फ्रॉम रेनबो ग्रुप और द फाउंटेन ऑफ गोल्ड ग्रुप उनको हेल्प करने के लिए तो रेगुलर ट्रेडिंग के लिए डेली चार्ट बेसिस पे टू डू द एम जो रेगुलर सबसे ज्यादा वॉल्यूम होता है एक्सेप्ट द एग्रीकल्चर उसको हम लोग देखने वाले हैं दिस लार्जली मोर ऑफ यू कैन से टेक्निकल एनालिसिस रेदर देन मैक्रो एनालिसिस जो मैं अपना फाउंटेन ऑफ गोल्ड सेटअप के जरिए इसके ऊपर नजर रखता हूँ बहुत कुछ चेंजेस हो चुका है ओवर द पास 24 टू 36 सिक्स आवर्स इन द कॉमोडिटी मार्केट वी हैड अ सिग्निफिकेंट नोटेबल करेक्शन फर्स्ट वी हैड अ नोटेबल करेक्शन मेजर वी कुड सी ऑन हियर जस्ट लाइक ऑन दिस डे just a moment first we had a major notable 6th to 7th of august just similar to the end of july but that correction got stronger and stronger in and still getting stronger in commodities which turned the background to yellow means my short trend turned neutral whenever background turns yellow i exit any kind of holistic position to the tune of 90 to 100% matlab main only tracker chhod sakta hu otherwise very likely i'll be 100% square off so commodity se mere liye signal aa raha hai bhai 100% niklo again main jo or jo alert place karunga that is two alert one is short trend bearish fir se mauka now the rainbow buy alert to do the buying and also short trend bullish alert to be aggressive on the buy side into commodities now iske sath what we got take a look at the agriculture where i agriculture like tried some buying but the end at the end of the day it failed to produce a full green candle and next very next day it has produced full exit dekhiye candle red and jo stop loss yahan pe tha jump kar ke it came to here and it got hit so commodities mein ye jo entry position it was fault agar jo main position chhod diya tha then next day definitely early hint trade that you exit from the agriculture this was not a good trade so we exited the agriculture i exited at a loss in the agriculture in this particular case so currently jo mujhe dikh raha hai na to agriculture is good rather base metal jo hai rather trying to form a base dbb mein heavy sell off ke baad momentum wise ek divergence dikh raha hai and finally ek base formation progress mein 64 फोर परसेंट चांस की मार्केट अब कॉन्सोलिडेट होगा लेट मी मेक इट लार्ज ताकि आप सब लोग देख सके विद अ क्लैरिटी दीज रीडिंग्स को सो जी वी हैव नाउ वी हैव टेकन अ लुक एट GSG main jo group hai commodities ka it was exit from the short not a major buy yet no major buy in base metals as a whole no major buy in DBA as a whole so let's look at the individual base metals we might find opportunities like we see we'll see copper no major opportunities in the copper but it's definitely exit point at least jo short ab rakhe the उसका 50 परसेंट तो डेफिनेट एग्जिट होना ही चाहिए क्योंकि शॉर्ट टर्म मोमेंटम बुलिश हो चुका है कंसोलिडेशन प्रोबेबिलिटी बढ़ चुका है रिलेटिवली स्मॉलर पोजीशन पहले जो पोजीशन था उसका 30 परसेंट से ज्यादा ना रखना सही होगा और उसका भी एग्जिट हो जाएगा इफ द बैकग्राउंड है स्टैंड येलो ना जैसे एल्यूमिनियम हम लोग एग्जिट होके वेट कर रहे हैं वेट कर पेशेंटली नाउ अब क्या मिल रहा है मुझे एल्यूमिनियम में एक पॉसिबल अपॉर्चुनिटी जो अभी तैयार हो 
लेट मी लोअर हाइड द लोअर बेस का जो स्ट्रेंथ टेबल है इसको हाइड कर देते हैं तो यहाँ पे पहली बार आज एल्यूमिनियम में एक बाई सिग्नल आ रहा है सिग्नल जो आ रहा है नोट कीजिएगा बहुत ही लो प्रोबेबिलिटी 29 परसेंट ओनली वन थर्ड चांस के सक्सेस हो सिग्नल इज वैलिड ओनली इफ इट स्टेज टिल द क्लोजिंग सो क्लोजिंग पे के पास बाद क्लोजिंग इन कॉमोडिटी मतलब शाम के टाइम नॉट साढ़े ग्यारह ही नहीं एग्जैक्टली बिकॉज इवनिंग टाइम यूएस मार्केट ओपन सब तब जाके क्लैरिटी मिलता है What's happening? But anyway, it is clear that aluminium is no longer short anymore. It is quite a clear signal. Or today, if the signal is valid, this will be an opportunity to enter some light positions. Next, as we progress, we will be able to build up on this aluminium. Next, we are going to take a look at. जिंक जिंक एक फुल एग्जिट दे दिया ये स्टडे इट गेव अ फुल एग्जिट बाई टर्निंग द बैकग्राउंड इन टू येलो इट वॉज अ सॉलिड अप मूव ऑल्सो हमें अर्ली मॉर्निंग थोड़े देर बाद ही इट्स दिखना चालू हो गया कि ग्रीन सॉक्स एंड बाई इवनिंग इट वॉज टर्निंग येलो सो इट वॉज अ फुल एग्जिट एंड फुल एग्जिट के बाद आज एक्चुअली इट इज usually as immediately nahi aata hai we tend to see some come back but here we are seeing immediate bounce back as a buy signal in zinc and market is trying to float remain floated or push above this level ek bar it breaks below this is a very very important level now because if this is broken ma stays below price below this level actual price not the candle actual price remains below this this is a risk that zinc will drop much bigger aur hum log aur bhi confirmed ho jayenge ki buy side tabhi only when the white cross ek bar positively iske upar move ho gaya unless there will be a risk that there will be a falter and down move so in such a scenario we definitely now don't want to see zinc moving below 250 if it starts moving below 250 then the bearish channel will open up it will just be a dead cat bounce from 250 and again bigger drop yahan tak to sustain this break maybe tonight zinc will go up further like 256 257 and will give more confidence ki ya yeah, it is going to remain floated ye float hua rahega ye jo flat line level hai iske upar zinc ka jo buy trade aa raha hai it is signal will be valid only if it stays till the closing time and also is the probability of success increases currently it is at 30% one third chance ki this buy trade will be successful so you should even we are start when we are starting we should start with a much lower quantity now we are after zinc we are going to take a look at gold and silver Gold has been in a range, nothing changed. Silver yesterday it gave a exit tonight with a fifty percent से ज़्यादा भी candle green हो चुका है, so it is signaling a full exit, though the maximum stop is not hit. To enter again to the short side, we'll need price action to be bearish, which in this candle is a full red candle, and to go on the long side. we need a rainbow buy signal first the buy signal then we'll see what happens now we'll look at the gold sorry the gold gold once again it's in a range we have discussed this also yesterday it is operating in a range we have a full green candle but the white cross is outside the candle body which is a warning so six and seven factors broadly agar dekha jaye seven nahi eight factors are bullish three factors are bearish 
and one factor is neutral. Some of white red ka jitne ka probability lag raha hai zada hai. So gold abhi tak once we get a crossover in the RSIX, maybe we'll be can build some position for the long side. As gold progresses farther, the range squeeze, okay, I expect it to 2385 to 24680 dollar range mein, probably gold is going to spend some more time. Ye jo base level hai, agar iska break ho gaya, then there can be open up a severe downside possibility, tab jaake open ho jai. Finally, we will see the energy group. MCX ka chart aaj istamal karenge instead of international. Aap log international bhi refer kar sakte. Crude oil, what we are getting? A correction back. Na to ye sell ke taraf hai, na buy ke taraf. Consolidation chance zada hai. So, we are avoid crude oil. Crude oil ka dusre time frame mein trade may come. So it depends on consa time frame may up trade kar. So I'm trading on the daily time frame. 125 crude is in a buy trend. It's in a good break. Solid break. Very likely lagra crude can further rise. Main resistance 6372. Main support 6251. So this is the new range of crude oil. So crude underlying ka jo dikra, that is bullish. Daily chart wise 6500 is the main resistance possibly further crude oil rise okay is to test karne ka possibility hai kyunki underlying jo 125 minute mein hum log dekhe wo strength is there in the trend finally lastly we have looking at natural gas last night we got a buy signal broadly a confirmed buy signal but today the green candle we have, white cross is outside the candle body. This is actually a warning. This is a low trade buy signal. Malla bauti low probability, one third chance bhi nahi isko jitne ka. Less than 30% chance ki ye jite ga. Uh, this buy signal, that means even the buy signal wins, probably future mein iska jitne ka probability strong ho ga. But at least it's not strong now. So yesterday it was an entry opportunity in UNG. So initially koi bhi ye start kar sakta hai base. Ki chota position leke because as strength strong hoga, hum log ko mauka milega ki natural gas mein position further build up kare. So opportunities kuch dikh rahe hai. Aluminium, jo stronger hoonga hoonga mein expect kar raha hoon ki Further strength dikhaya. We are getting a zinc. We are getting natural gas. Where we have also looked at crude oil to be strong in 125 minutes chart. Others are more in range, more in a comeback mode. So that's all friends. This is the daily dose of commodities. I hope this video of ko help ho ra. Agar help ho ra, don't forget to like and subscribe all the best from my side and as always happy trading